Hi guys, welcome to the Kogoshaw United YouTube channel. My name is Gareth, the media and someone direct, I don't know what they even want to call me D now. So yeah, basically my right club is filming and videoing and general website stuff. So yeah, the idea of this video is me rambling towards the camera and basically just telling you guys my thoughts and a little update on the media stuff. So media wise, we are progressing incredibly well. Last week our website had 398 hits. The week before that, we averaged at around 300. So in terms of progressing, we are progressing quite well. And the more teams we play, the more stuff we're getting on the site, which means there's more visibility for us in the search engine. Um, there's so much coming up. We have so many games. I think we actually have about five games this month in terms of home games, I believe. Um, the stuff on the website is still a bit out of date. I need to go onto the FA website and get that. But yeah, um, you know, match days, we're starting now to get a really solid production plan in place. Um, I've actually got pretty much my production plan for the rest of the season's games laid out in my head. I've got editing, that all the profiles sorted out in Premiere, so they all look the very same. My editing technique is very similar too. So it's all starting to push out and, you know, we have some really, really great people starting at the club now. We've got Lewis Little Legs, we've got the great Bradford's team. It's really good because we're now starting to get a community atmosphere going in the club and that is... Without a doubt, one of the most, the best thing about the club is we are so community orientated. And, you know, I work with, or I've worked with several different football clubs over the last few years, and nothing has come close to Coggershaw. You know, Cliff really has it, and he just, he just clicks. The team just click. The club just clicks. The fans will have come down from Coggershaw Town, back down to Coggershaw United. People, we get people coming in on match days who will watch Coggershaw Town and then watch us. It really is, it's just brilliant. It really is cool. Um, you know, Cliff, Brian, everyone, just everyone who works at the club is just doing an absolute splendid job. Um, you know, on match days, it's so great because the players are loving it. I go up to the players whenever they're, um, whenever they're training and I film them and they're like, you know, smiling towards the camera and Betty at like full time. It just, it just makes it what it is. You know, I don't see a lot of other clubs aside from hashtag um, do what we do. Uh, you know, a lot of other clubs will maybe update their Twitter, update their Facebook, and, that, and that's that's nothing towards them. Um, it's just that I think the way we do it is very unique in the way that we film immediate reactions of players, um, especially against Newbury Forest. Um, it was basically like I was on the top of the gantry, as you guys probably saw me, and basically I jumped down off this like ladder, was like rocking, and I literally picked, grabbed my tripod, uh, my shoulder rig, and just ran over towards the players filming. I just filled their immediate reactions. I didn't really know if it was going to be good or not, but it actually turned out to be the best bit of footage I've got all season because it was just fantastic seeing the players' emotions. Uh, I think it was George who came up to him and was like, "Yes, get in." It was just, it was just really, really good, guys. Um, and I really urge you, if, if, if you know, if you don't want to speak to the camera, that's fine. Um, but you know, it'd be nice to get some more interviews with some different people. Um, but we also want to just continue what we're doing and just making sure that each each match day we're providing as much coverage on social media as possible um, because I think the more visibility we have on Google, the more people are going to hit our website, which is just absolutely fantastic. Um, the great thing is now Betty, the captain, has let us use his camera, what is just phenomenal because that means we now have two cameras. So in events like the one we had the other day where I basically just jumped down and used my camera, it was on my shoulder rig and... Um, Betty's camera was filming the match. Really, really cool. Um, I will say though, um, I want to make these videos a bit more uh, regular of me just rambling towards the camera because I think that's kind of like um, a video entry of how the club is going. Uh, I have suggested it to Cliff, but yeah, I'm uh, just trying to find Cliff on a good day really because obviously he works full time and so do I and you know, everyone at the club does. We all work full time, but football at the weekend is, is our pride and joy and you know, we want to do everything we can to preserve that. And I think the way we're doing everything is a bit unique and that makes us really, really cool. So yeah, I better stop rambling now, guys. Um, but I think our next game is against Holland away this Saturday. I won't be going to it because I don't go to away games. But um, if you guys do want to hit up the subscribe button down below if you want to hear updates i'll probably do like an update from that match um and just say like if we won or lost or not and just again describe from what cliff or uh, someone's told me about the game and i'll see if i can get any if i'll ask some of the players to film some of their reactions to um, that'd be really cool and i can get up on the channel but in the meantime guys make sure you do do hit the subscribe button down below and i'll uh, thank you guys for watching and guys i'll see you guys next time and have a fantastic day